Okay then, we are back with our Armenian campaign in the RTR Imperium Director mod for Total War Rome Rebusted. And we finally uh, been attacked by somebody other than rebels. Well, actually we've been attacking rebels from the beginning of the campaign, but now we've been attacked by an actual faction, Atropatene, uh, some guy called Mithridates. Name rings a bell. Uh, probably very common in part of the world and in that era. Now we're quickly rushing a couple of generals and some horse archer units um, over there to Kabbalah. But we may not get there in time. Oh well, that's the way it goes. Right, we have left this general uh, besieging the faces. Right, now we've got some. Good alliances going already. Uh, we just got an alliance with the Romans. We're allied to Bactria, uh, the Parthians, Pontus, Bosporans, and Scythians who are to our north, and the Cappadocians who are to our southwest, I guess. To our west. Right. Um, if we can capture this one, it will give us another trading port in the Black Sea. And there's also, Trapezos and uh, Carusus, uh, which are also rebels at the moment, and will give us even more ports and even more money, which is all very nice. So, let's see if we're actually going to get attacked here or not, or if we can get over there in time to save Gabala. What do we think? Can we? Can we do it? Aha, uh -huh. they backed away. Ooh, they didn't think they could do it. Well, if they don't think they can take it, and they had a general and two units. Oh, wait. Oh, he's also a general. I thought he was a captain. He looked like... Okay, can't see him from the front. Right, nice strap models. So we got... One horse archer from there. Right, send him along. Can't quite reach him. Uh, build even better roads up there. Right, did we get anyone in there? Nope. Might as well send them to join up with him. We're going to be able to save that settlement. Uh, now I'm fairly certain of it. Right, we should have a horse archer from there. Move him over. Uh, getting through these mountains is annoying. And I'll send one. Oh, he really doesn't move very far, does he? I guess we'll send him through there. We've got that spy who's coming back. There he is. In fact, I'll send you, send you along here. We've also got a diplomat that we're sending back. On you Seleucids. Uh, yep, they're still not going for it, are they? And yep, this one as well. And then the one in northern Italy. He's about to head on through the um, Alps. If he can stop them being into settlements. There he goes. Right, does any of that affect us? No, it doesn't. Yeah, we we'll keep getting blocked. Not even certain we need to recruit any more units in those smaller settlements. Right, we can get units, so let's start improving that. That will give us the horse archers down here. And you're growing pretty quickly. What can you get up there? Only a couple of units. Right, let's improve that. So we've got five horse archer units, did we? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I missed one. Right. You had the horse archer, you did. Okay. So our population is going up nicely there. 
the better cavalry. The right cavalry. I think these are going to be more effective though. Alright, keep on moving. So a couple of those won't get there in time, but you know, these three definitely will, and gives us a chance to kill off two generals, but no action there. Right, um, so you can actually not get any units, so I'm going to have to put that building back in for the recruitment or uh, construction. Those Ajapateni, they've made a mistake. Definitely, but I don't think they have too much territory, and I think we can definitely outproduce them. Yeah, you go ahead, mate. I don't know what he did with his two extra units, but we're going to get a battle. Right now, we could probably get the order resolved there, but you know what? Let's go and fight it because that's what we're here for. A sudden total war. The gods favour the bold, said Devo. Alright, we are not going to wait. Here's our units. Right, that's our general's unit. I do have the um, sub mod on. The unit cards. That's our units. Right, those are shock cab, unlike the Roman general, uh, which are melee cab, I think. Right, you're going to be up there on that flank. Run, rabbit, run! Now, uh, where's the enemy? All the way over there. Right. He's going to come in. He's he's got sixty one. He's got seventy four. He can probably take them. Uh, now I've got the default for run, but uh, let's try to wear him down first. Even though those are skirmish cav, they will get tired running all the way over there. I guess their generals are probably going to look very similar to mine. Asian Royal Bodyguards, what are mine called? Armenian Royal Bodyguards. They've got a lot of armour on them though, on their arms and their legs, compared to mine. Alright, he's closing in, he's going to be in range very soon. They don't have shields, which is a good thing for me. Yeah. Alright, shoot them. Destroy them. That's also going to draw them closer to my other generals. Yeah, got two on the first volley. And I believe they can fire backwards as well. I believe they can. What's that called? Parthian shot, isn't it? Oh yeah, look at that. They are taking them down. No problem -o. No problem, mate. Didn't get anyone on that volley, though. Alright, let's get you to charge in on them now. Blow your little horn. He hasn't used up much ammunition. Those are going to be so effective. Alright, he's turned around. Stop him from firing. Cease fire. But I think this one's trying to withdraw. Looks like they're withdrawing. Yeah, he's down to 12 already. He's about to go. That's not going to save him. Yeah, the other one withdrew. Yeah, see? Smart AI. Knew they weren't going to win it. Yep, he's gone. 
we might still be able to chase him down on the campaign map. Uh, yeah, we got 61, we lost 5. He killed 16. Yeah, took them out, no problem. Those are Carthaginian units there, I think. I think they are. Could be Massilian or Massaisley. Alright, now come on down here. Now put in a watchtower. We'll see what's going on. They do cost a thousand. They ain't cheap. Alright, go and stand on that bridge. Now, do they have a territory out there? Here's the road. There it is. Now, next turn we'll be able to reach them. He's got four units in there, but I bet we could take them. Plus, we've got these ones coming along already. This one I'll be able to reach them. Yeah. I think we can take them without too much of a problem. Is that all of them? It was four, right? Uh, so two, three, four. Isn't there one more? Ah, they've sent a single unit of spearmen over here. Well, I'm going to fight it. Do you want to see me? It's only a single unit. Um, yeah, go on. We'll at least get to see the. Um, how to pretend any spearmen. They look very colourful on their unit card. They kind of look like the Sparabara unit. The enemy Mighty General. Let's see how far. Oh, they're, they're not very far away. Let's get up there and uh, shoot them from the flank. Listen to that music. Tell me it's not cool. Look at those shields. Oh yeah, look at that first volley. We're going to kite them around. I want to see how much ammunition we have. Because uh, it's a good test to see whether one of these units can wipe out one of these units. And still have ammunition left over to go after any other ones. So they had 240 men, and uh, they used up hardly any ammunition. It would be more effective to shoot them from this flank. Come on, come over here. Alright, I might have to manually move them. Plus we have some height advantage over here. They are firing all the time. I want them firing into the unshielded side. Alright, almost down to about half. Come on. Are they giving up? Kill them. Now they're definitely in range, even firing uphill. Alright, they've turned around. Now you're getting close to half our ammunition though. They do that weird thing where they all go into a big like ball over there. Quickly, alright, down to about half, or less than half.
it going? Now to 60. Still got ammunition left over. Uh, considering they don't have a general and the number of like, casualties, they have not broken, have they? Come on, speed that up. Almost over. Now they've broken. We got down to about 15 before they broke. We obviously didn't lose anyone, but we did almost use up all of the ammunition. And the general was the last one to go. Hmm, right. Give me a man of the hour event. A lot of those loading screens are for Macedonian units, I think. I'm not sure how many loading screens there are. I'll have to go and look in the game files. There's quite a few. Alright, so they sent that unit probably from over here. Alright, now that's their capital, Gazaka. And they've only got four units in there. And I did get another one. From here, one over, and we get another one from there. They were most effective, most effective. I want to say that's all of them. Yeah, I think that's all of them. Right, confident commander. They've broken their alliances. Uh, they've allied to them. Right, you should be able to get some units. Good. Get an even better road in. What do I need to do there? We don't really get units, so we don't technically need that one. Uh, Syrian, slightly over half. That will affect public order eventually. So let's get that taken care of. Alright, we'll just move our agents. Make sure all of those are moved. Come on. Great one. All right, we might be able to find the Allobroges. No, there's the Insubri. Still making over 10k a turn. Right, and we've got three more turns over there. And I did put one more unit in. Yep. Mm. We can get through another turn. Now, the uh, draw out option does not work very well in this mod or in. Rome Remastered. Um, they've got Asian archers. Alright, let's test that out. Um, most of you know what the draw out exploit is in Medieval 2, and that really doesn't work in this one. I've tested it out numerous times, and uh, I'll see if I can demonstrate it in this one. Well, I don't know why it doesn't work in this, but it hasn't so far. Right. 
I'm not sure who has the better range. No, you can see the range. 130. Right. Actually, let me quickly pause it. There's no way of finding out what their range is, is there? Yeah. I would imagine that we outrange them. They're going to have less armor than that other unit that we fought. I mean, they're trying to get pretty close to us. I think we can just speed that up. So they'll probably die quicker, but we don't want to be in range of them. We want to stay out of their range. Like so. Yep. It's got to stay out of their range. Because we also don't have that much in the way of armour. Looks like we'll need less arm, uh, ammunition to wipe out this unit. Are they trying to run away? Down to ten. There they go. Yeah. About half our ammunition, maybe slightly less. And they're down to one. It's going to be the captain again. Getting close to the border. But he's not going to make it. Come on, give us a man of the hour event. I did get one of those last night in my personal Roman campaign. So it does still happen, just not very often. War spears not the brave, but the cowardly. Count me a coward then. Aha, uh -huh. this one we'll pull back from. At least we can see that they're sending some extra units. Ooh, now they have Persian noble cavalry, which would probably decimate our Armenian horse archers. Ah, they they have the Takabara, which are an axe unit, I believe. I believe they have axes and the uh, crescent shield there. Right, median spearmen. Yeah, that's the ones we killed before. Right, see if we can actually get away from them. They might send someone out from their settlement, but no, we haven't. Right, you're coming down to help them out. Right. Now we probably won't beat them, but still. We bought three units, possibly from that settlement. We need you up over here. You are now in striking distance. Now we don't have any infantry, so we can't actually use the siege equipment. Now we've got the Two generals in there, and some very light units. 2500 population. Alright. See if we can get you coming down from there. Come on over. And we'll recruit some more of those, because they are most useful. Just go through our messages and then we'll end the uh, episode. Alright. The population is going up nicely. Alright, so we're going to have maybe some slingers if we get that. Alright. And we'll build those two as well. Um, 
We could leave it on low taxation. We don't need to. But we could. Ooh, uh, those are all allied now. A lot of people. Right, that seems like a good place to end this one as well. So we've got our first real enemy. We've got one of their settlements under siege. I'm confident that we can win that one. Maybe there's some uh, different mercenaries. Armenians, Armenians, Albanian Califracts, Iberian nobles. Uh, basically the same ones. And... Uh, yeah, we can do something down here. We can annoy them and distract them from what's going on up there for the time being. But yeah, we'll probably claim another uh, settlement there. This one I'm confident enough to send down here after these rebels. But we'll see you in the next one.